A woman from Youngstown is offering a reward to catch the criminals who broke into her salvage yard, beat her friend, and stole a tow truck. First News reporter Tyler Trill talked to her today about why she would no longer feels safe in her own business. Yeah, Nicole Valley and her fiance buy used cars and they, they use a lot on South Avenue in Youngstown to either repair them or scrap them. Now Valley says she, she doesn't even feel comfortable being there after a group of people broke in Friday morning. Nicole Valley says she feels targeted. I honestly believe that yeah, it, somebody was sent here to get, they were sent here to get that truck. That's all they kept telling Brian, we want the truck. Around 1 a.m. Friday, police say someone broke into the salvage yard and tried to steal a tow truck. It's a white Ford with SNS Auto Salvage written on the side. Brian Freet, who was doing mechanical work for the yard, chased the person off. Freet told police about 30 minutes later, while he was fixing the broken chain from the fence, a group of people came back and began beating him with his own tools. Police say they even tried to run him over with another car. This time, they were able to steal the tow truck. It actually looked like he was shot in the head and he was covered in blood and he kept saying the tow truck's gone, the tow truck's gone. Valley and says like, she's oh. offering a $1,000 reward if someone can help the police track down the tow truck, which she relies on for her livelihood. It's really important to us because, I mean, it feeds our children. However, Valley says this is more about getting justice for her friend Brian and not finding the truck. He's a good guy and they, he didn't deserve what they did to him. Valley says Freet's been in and out of the hospital since Friday morning. Police say he had cuts all over his body when they visited him, and one was so deep it went down to his skull. From the newsroom, Tyler Troll, 27 First News at 6.